The search for a missing Skokie woman intensified today as dozens of volunteers gathered at Evanston's Tibetan Alliance of Chicago to get their marching orders. It is here where Sering Wang Yell's daughter believes her mother was trying to get to when she disappeared Monday afternoon. There was a service Monday evening at 5.30. And my dad and her spoke earlier in the day, and my dad told her that they will be leaving at 5. It appears, however, that Wang Yao wanted to leave earlier, with police saying she was spotted on camera leaving her condo just across the street from Old Orchard Mall around 4 p.m. A surveillance photo released yesterday shows her at Evanston's Levy Senior Center around 6 p.m. Her family believes she must have gotten on the 97 bus to get there, although CTA have yet to provide them with surveillance footage to confirm this. She moved to the Skokie area in, uh, in March, so it is a new area too. Um, she's been here, so she knows this area well, but she's been always coming from the south, you know, from um, Rogers Park to this location. Because her English is limited, friends and family believe Wang Yell may have had a hard time asking for help if she ran into trouble. A grid search of the area surrounding the senior center was being done today, with volunteers told to go door to door. Even while it's been six days, those who know her refuse to give up. She's kind of an enigma. She comes to the community center. She loves to sing. She loves to dance. It probably is I would say what tethers her to the community here. Um, and so I think that we can all feel her absence. As of now, investigators say there's no indication of foul play and that anyone with any information on Weingel's whereabouts should call 911 or the direct phone line for the Skokie Police Department. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.